guys, I hope you're doing well. This is Jen Shikor again with another interesting video. Now, this channel is designed to entertain, to educate, and to inspire you all there through the videos that we make. My name is Jen Shikor, and welcome to my channel. For the raw subscribers, thank you so much for keeping on. For the new ones, please. Don't go anywhere. And if you've not subscribed, please hit that subscribe button, share, like, and let us grow as a family. Thank you so much for keeping on and may God bless you. Now, during the last video, I informed you guys that God blessed us with a newborn. And uh, through that period, like the maternity period and the break that I had gone, I learned so much. You know, we keep on learning every day. And now this time around, I learned a better way of sterilizing baby's equipments and by baby's equipments i mean the utensils they use especially after six months when they start weaning you know it's recommended exclusive breastfeeding for six months and then after six months you start weaning especially during that time did you need to have something to sterilize their products and their utensils so don't go anywhere something good is coming up Welcome back. Now, as I've told you, I have learned sterilizing my baby's equipment. And uh, it's very important, by the way. Let's go there. Because uh, well, the babies are so fragile. Their immunity is, yeah, it's delicate. They're just delicate. Let me just say they're just delicate. And therefore, we need to sterilize them. Chances so everything they need. They eat everything they they use to eat, everything they do, especially even when they are teething, they put so many things in their mouth. And all these things should be sterilized because you never know the environment that we are living in. There's so many diseases, there's so many germs, and we don't want our babies to go to keep on going to hospital and getting medications, you know. So there are things we can avoid. Understand? Now I got this is called Atomic TP Sterilizer. It is a microwave sterilizer, by the way. And uh, this is what I use and I've been using since I gave birth to my baby. And it's so effective, it's so friendly, and uh, I can just say it's just a deal. If you have this thing, it's just a deal. Now, I want us to share with you how to use it. Eh? This sterilizer comes in three parts. We have the first part, which is the cover. This is the cover. The cover. Then we have the second part, which is this thing. I don't know, in the middle part, it's used to put, it's the one you used to place, as I'll show you later, your, your utensils. And now we have the third part, which is the bowl line, where you put water, and then you put your things and you cover, okay? So this is how we use it. Welcome back. Now, as I've told you guys, this is the sterilizer, which comes in three parts again. The first one is the cover. Second one is the one you place your utensils. As you can see, it has hollows. And now the third one is this. Okay? Now, this is how you use it. You first remove the cover. Assume, assume you had already closed it. Eh? Like that. It's lockable like that. Then, here are the openings. Like the locks. Here and here. On this other side. This and this. Okay? You press them inside and you open it. So you, once you open it, you put 200 ml of water inside here inside here this thing is hollow therefore the water is inside here and then now you start placing your your utensils okay assuming like my baby has right now my baby has started cleaning i put the balls here the feeding cup over there the nipple the the nipple for breastfeeding over there as you can see this one's over here like it can take so much, you just arrange your things as you would want. You understand? The feeding bottle as well, there. The lids here and here. You understand? You place you place them as you would want them to be. 
And then, assuming it's full now, you cover it again. You cover your... And you've covered it. Now, this is ready to be put in the microwave. Okay? And before you put it in the microwave, you make sure it has water inside. Okay? As I did. And then you put your things, then you put it in the microwave. Guess here's my microwave. What you do, you set the you first open the microwave. Sorry. Once you open the microwave, you put in your sterilizer. Okay. So that's what we are doing. You put in the sterilizer. As you can see, it fits on so well. So now you close your microwave. And then now once you close your microwave, you start it for five minutes. Five minutes only. Five minutes only, okay? Uh, two, three, four, five. And then now we can start the microwave. As you can see, I don't know whether you can see inside. It's a... Now, guys, as you can see, we're done. Five minutes are done, but uh, we cannot get it out of the microwave immediately because, as you can see, guys, it's so steamy, eh? so steamy inside. Eh? This thing is too hot that you cannot even. It's burning your fingers. Like it's not as hot as metal would be but since this thing is not a good conductor of heat but itself it's hot we are getting it from the microwave again with your bare hands would be will not be good so we keep it for five minutes in there having opened our microwave leave the microwave open let it rest for five minutes it will have a bit, a bit cooled down and then now you can take your things and use them on your babies okay teethers feeding bottles breast pumps milk cans cups balls anything call it anything the baby uses their toys at times you can even sterilize their toys because they they literally bite the toys okay so guys we've come to the end of the video thank you so much for viewing thank you for your love thank you for your subscription you guys don't know how much motivate me like you keep me going and thank you so much this video was educative i know to many of us and i know that many of you will do the same to their kids Cindy, now i am dropping the number of my plug down here so that if you need such or anything related to the babies or any household you can always give them a call and they'll deliver to your doorstep may god bless you i love you guys and keep on keeping on mm -hmm.